Hello there, I am Giant Quill from Pokemon Crystal. On the last part, we caught Suda Wudo. We also take on two trainers in the about south of here. And uh, we made Takutik City. And also, off screen, I um went back to the Pokemon Salon. It's only open on s Tuesdays and Saturdays, as far as I know. And I made, I made it to where um, Mystic was happy. So that's awesome, that's what I wanted to do. So I have Mystic up front right here. And I'm going to teach it Headbutt, actually. So yeah. Um, let's see here, yeah, nice. Headbutt, cool, let's teach your headbutt. I did have a failed recording, so that kind of stinks. But, uh, that's whatever. I'm kind of still mad, though, honestly. Because I didn't buy enough Awakenings for the gym. I won't take the gym on until the next part, though, obviously. Because I learned my lesson about trying to squeeze in the gym, too, in this part. Let's just, let's give a sand attack, honestly. Mystic for sand attack, and Mystic Grand Headbutt. Cool, good for you. I'm still really pissed off about the failed recording, though. Cause like I beat, I got through a whole lot, I was like a, th a 30 minute, 33 minute recording and I was at the gym, I was battling Morty, the gym leader, and he only had his haunter and one of his haunters and his Gengar left, but I didn't buy freaking enough stupid uh, awakening, so I'm really pissed off honestly about that. Like I'm really pissed, I have to restart this recording and stuff, but that's okay, it's whatever. I'm just really mad, okay we started about you, you had the Jolteon, okay? I don't care about your dialogue, I'm, I'm still really pissed off about that. So I'm going to be pissed off during this part, probably. You know, I, honestly, just I am. I'm sorry, there's no way to get around it. I, failed recordings suck, you know? They suck. I just hate them, you know? But whatever, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to try to keep be positive and calm down a little bit, but uh, I'm still kind of really mad about that. But here's the very point, level 17, it's a male. So uh, let's switch to with the headbutt, I guess. Let's go for the headbutt then. Should do at least half because the headbutt on all these evolutions did at least half. But then again, the no, it did about a third right there, so that kind of stinks. Let's give another headbutt then. Hi, yeah, yeah, okay, so yeah, could go to awesome. I'll take it. There you go, Mystic with level 21, Austin. Nice. We defeated the Komodo Kuni, uh, Komodo Kuni, Kuni, I guess, like okay, whatever. You're stronger than you look. Thank you. Thanks for 1,224 book dollars. You also, you always give to 1,224 book dollars in here, I guess, as the prize money amount. Isn't my Burnett pretty? Uh, oh, a Pokemon battle? Yeah, let's battle. Yeah, okay. This, I think she has a Umbreon, if I were to guess. Yeah, okay, just what I remember. Okay, yeah. It's an Umbreon, yay. Good for you. It's level, it's level 17 in male, so that's cool. Not tail up shoot. Well, I guess it's always a defense, but that's okay. I want to use headbutt though. Pursuit, okay. Let's see how much this does. Doesn't do too much, so that's good. Let's go for the headbutt now. With lower defense, I mean, it should do a little bit more. Oh, fudge. Come on. You should do more than that. Whatever. Let's go for the headbutt. Sand attack doesn't affect it that turn because it's still hit. Awesome. Sand attack, um, but it failed. You tried to do sand attack again, or you ever tried to do sand attack, but it failed. Good for us, good for us, good for us. Awesome, almost level, almost level 22, awesome. I don't have my any Pokemon left. Thanks for 1,224. That's kind of a shame. I think this Komodo Girl has an Espeon, and the last one has a Flareon, of course, because process of elimination for the between the five evolutions in Johto. You know, uh, Umbreon. Espeon, Jolteon, Flareon, and a big Poion, so yeah. I'm gonna skip through your dialogue. Sorry, but not sorry. <laughs> okay, here's another Komodo girl. She has an Espeon, like I said. It's level 17 male, probably. Let's see if I'm right. It's level 17 and male. Okay, cool, I was right. So yeah, let's go for the headbutt. Let's just tail up on Mystic, okay? Good for you, I guess. Good for you. It is about half awesome. Let's, get, let's use another headbutt. It's gonna be a jerk in your sand attack. There we go. It still hits awesome. Nice. And yeah, Mystic is now level 22. Awesome. I think it's level 23 to wins quick attack, which is pretty cool. Uh, come on to go say I was defeated. Okay. Oh, so close. I almost had you. Sure. Sure. <laughs> Here she, uh, last is ult, uh, last is, um, last is, um, Flareon. You have, you have lonely Pokemon. May I see a battle? Did she say lonely Pokemon or only Pokemon? I forget. I don't even know. So here's Komodo girl, Neko, I guess. How do you pronounce her name? This Flareon's level 17 and male, just like the other ones. Jeez, okay, let's use, um, headbutt on this thing. 
I think it'll do like about third because Flaren has good defense, but then it gets us half right there. Awesome. Let's give us Ember, okay. Interesting. Let's give for another headbutt, I guess. And yeah, there we go, it goes down. Awesome. Nice, okay. I'm gonna go Neko as defeated. Cool. Um, oh yes, you're very strong. Thanks for the same amount of money you, everyone gave me in this battle. In this, in this room, I guess you could say. Let's start with this guy again. Not only are the Komodos great at dancing, great dancers, they're also skilled at Pokemon. I always challenge them, but I've never even left a scratch. The way you battled, it was like watching a dance. It was a rare sight to see, treat to see or something, sight to see or something, I don't know. I want to, you to have this, don't worry, take it. We get the HMZ3, which is Surf, which will teach to um, Broslo. Yeah, put this HMZ3 in the pocket, in pocket, like Surf. So move that, wait, Pokemon, uh, sw what's Pokemon? So swim across waters, so that's awesome. So before I forget, let's uh, teach that to sw Broslo, actually. Yeah, there we go, nice. We don't have the badge for it to use outside battle yet, but that's okay. Yeah, Bristol is the only one I can learn of, of course. Yeah, Bristol is trying to learn surf, but I can't learn my full moves. Do we want to learn for surf? Yes. Let's get rid of a uh, tackle on so we don't need tackle anymore. Cool. Yeah, nice. And Bristol and surf. Awesome. Cool. And what I'm going to do before I forget is I'm going to... Is I'm going to, uh... Just, um... Buy some more Awakenings, honestly, because I'll need them. I'll need them so much. I'll play like four more honestly because I want to just not win on awakenings honestly. So now I should have six awakenings. Let me just double check in my bag. Um, or pack, whatever. Um, let's see here. Awakenings. Um, yeah, we have six now. Awesome. Okay, so now we're gonna take on the Burn Tower. Okay, here's Yus- oh, I actually don't know what you do his name yet. Oh gosh, dang it. Okay, I had to take a drink of my flavored water there for a second, jeez. My name is Yusween. I'm the- I'm on the trail of a Pokemon named Suicune. And you are? Steven, glad to meet you. I heard rumors that Suicune is in this burned tower. So I came to see if they were true, I guess that's what you said. I, I could do fast, dang it. But where exactly could it be? Interesting. Okay, here's the gym leader, freaking Morty, who freaking- Swap my team after his freaking Gengar came out in battle, but whatever. Okay, yeah, the critics gym leader has to study what are said to be the legendary Pokemon Suicune and Dan Raikou. Sween is here, so I decided to investigate to the tower with him. Okay, interesting. Here's our rival Smart over there, as you see right there. But yeah, let's take him on. We have to go around, though. We might run into a Pokemon. It's like almost guaranteed that we'll run at least one wall encounter while trying to get to Smat. There we go, there's the one encounter. Yeah, I told Mystic to use Headbutt there on that rat. I thought that was like level 15. Took it out on one hit. Awesome. There's Smat. Okay, yeah. Oh, it's you. I came looking for some legendary Pokemon that they might have. They say roost here, but there's nothing here. Nothing after all the trouble of coming to this dump. No way. It's all your fault. How is it my fault? You better not get me mad, Smat. I already beat you in my failed recording. I'll beat you again. Don't don't piss me off, man. I'm pissed already. Jeez. Smat would like to battle, of course. Yeah, okay, Haunter, yeah, yeah, oh, Haunter, yeah. I hate these Haunters because <laughs> I ended up losing against uh, Morty, who's still at a Haunter left, you know? Okay, I'm gonna switch out because, you know, Mystic doesn't have any effective moves on it. I don't make a pack. Jeez. Let's go to, um, let's go to Blaze, I guess, because Blaze has Bite. we really super effective. Uh, how much you want to bet this Haunter's gonna use Curse? I know it. You gotta put a curse on boys, of course you are, you jerk. You freaking jerk. Let's go for bite, I guess. Ah, uh, wick. No, 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 no. That's what I was worried about, getting pale. Getting blaze, having blaze to get, you know, F left out there and get pale eyes with the wick. Oh yeah, yeah, the stupid haunter needs to go bye-bye. Jeez, oh yeah, his ghastly evolved in the haunter, by the way, that's why he has a ghastly, or a haunter right there. Good for haunter, I guess. Okay, Zubat, let's go back to, a. Uh, Let's go back to Mystic because Mystic actually can affect with Zubat because it's flying and poison type. Um, so yeah, it's gonna just headbound this thing. Now I don't know if switching out uh, gets rid of the curse, but I could be wrong. Let's go for the headbutt. Zubat's level 20 in male. 
I think the haunter was level 20 but female if I already guessed. Ooh, it flinched awesome. It's covered in the head by awesome. Things are looking my way for once. Yeah, awesome. Nice, okay. Let's go level 23, awesome. Let's try my quick attack, okay. Yeah, I can't wait my four moves, so I don't move. Quick attack, I guess. Okay, which mission should we give it? Let's get a tail whip, honestly. There we go, nice. Cool. Cool. Okay, I have a Magnemite, okay. I'm um, gonna actually do the switch your trick actually. Just to get um mystic some more experience. Let's now let's switch out. Okay, let's go to um let's go to uh Sanders I guess. Supersonic. Didn't affect Sanders good for us. Let's go for the smut up, I guess see how much it does. Is this Magnemite's level 18 in genderist? That's pretty cool. Uh, it puts in the red awesome. It actually, what is it actually? Sonic Boom still hits though. So it's gonna, it's gonna leave with Sanders with 40 HP because it always did 20 HP, no matter, 20 HP no matter what. So that's good for you, I guess. Good for Smat. And yeah, his last is is Quilava. Nice, okay. So if you chose a. Uh, if you chose Chikorita like me, he'll have a Quilava. If you chose a uh, Quilava like. or uh, Cyndaquil like. Uh, Smat, then have a Krakenol, and if you chose a, a cro uh, Totodile, he will have a, um, a Bay Leaf, just like me. So yeah, let's get back to Mystic, I guess. That would be nice. Okay, yeah. There's a motorcycle going in the background. I don't know if my microphone's if picked that up, but that's okay. Let's go for the headbutt, honestly. Let's get a smoke screen to lower Mystic's accuracy. That's just great, man. That's just great. Okay, headbutt still hits, that's awesome. Does about one third, okay. Let's use another headbutt. Let's give us Emperor on Mystic now. Gotta be careful here so Mystic doesn't faint. Hit missed. Let's go for the quick attack then. Yeah, quick attack hits, awesome. I might want to switch out after this, jeez. Yeah, I'm gonna switch out, because that could have been a critical hit and that would have been really bad. Let's go to, um, let's go to Brussel, I guess. Brussel is this, um, uh, Ember, I guess. That's good. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Ember, Ember, Ember. You give this Qual off a medal or something for using Ember so many times. Let's go for the Surf just to finish it off. So, yeah. I like Surf's battle animation for this game. It's pretty cool. There we go, nice. Super effective, awesome. Smat was defeated. Awesome. Hmm. <laughs> this is why I hate battling limps. I just beat you. There's no challenge in it. Whatever. Thanks for 1,320 poker dollars, man. But I already beat you. Don't call me a wimp. Ah, uh, whatever. You would never be able to catch your ninja Pokemon anyway. Wait, wait, wait. The ground shaking. Ah, we're all shocked. Ah, we fall through a hole. Hmm. <laughs> so, what are you doing falling into a hole? Some genius you are. Serves you right. But what does Smat know that this is where Entei Raikou and Suicune are? So let's go simply up a couple of stasis. There's Raikou, there's Entei, and there's Suicune. You can tell by the colors, kinda. So awesome. Not kinda, you can actually, if you play Pokemon, honestly, if you played this game before, you know the colors of the three legendary dogs, beasts, hamsters, whatever you want to call them. Suicune actually stayed a while for us and stayed in the front of us for a second. There's your swing again. I dug a hole here too. I was shocked. Suicune raced like a boy right in front of my eyes. For 10 years I've chased Suicune, and I finally got to see it. Uh, I'm all choked up. Steven, I owed all this all to you. Thank you. I heard that the Legend of Pokemon of Equity tests chosen humans by allowing them to get close. I'm going to track Suicune. Steven, let, let's meet again. Farewell. Okay, yeah. And over here to the right is where you can use strength, but we don't have strength yet, and we don't can't use the outside of battle yet. Either. Okay, that stupid get, <laughs> that stupid coughing poisoned my uh poisoned my all over my knock towel. See, so, yeah, we can't even use strength right there because we don't have it. Yeah, there goes the poison. Okay, that's all. That's all okay, that's all really that's left. Um, and they can use uh, rock smash up here, I think. Uh, but we're at the at the beginning of the um tower again. But yeah, we don't have rock smash either. That kind of stinks. So let's hope we can make it out here without running into a Pokemon. Yes, we can. Awesome. So yeah. 
Let's see, I'm about 16 minutes of recording time. I've learned my lesson not to go after the gym, because apparently I lost against Morty, because I have enough freaking awakenings. So I'm going to end the part right here. So I'm going to meet you guys. Well, the next part will start right in front of the Pokemon gym. And we'll take on the gym from there, that critique City Pokemon gym, where they use ghost type Pokemon. So yeah, so this has been Jacko again. I would like to thank you for again goodbye. And I'll see you guys next time with Pokemon Crystal Walkthrough Guide.